Hey guys, it's Haley. So today we're going to be working on getting our walls around our town. And we've also got our builder's hut and this citizen house upgraded so that we could have um, our first child born here. They just went up, but her name, it's right there. <laughs> it's Maya. Uh, but this is our builder's hut. I believe this is level three now. But uh, yeah, this is what it looks like. I really like the roof. It looks cool. And this is the citizen's house. The other thing I wanted to point out is that we have a new, uh, we have a new citizen. That's her. I love her name. So this is our, our new citizen, Maya. So we lost our forester and our builder to some strays. Uh, but the new citizen that we got was Penelope over here, and she's going to be our new forester. And our builder, Houston Jones, uh, his his little daughter over here grew up, so she's going to be our new builder. Um, so there she goes. I am quite upsetty spaghetti. <laughs> uh, but anyway, this is what the house looks like in the daylight. You couldn't really see it all that well at nighttime. So this is that. This is the inside here. Upstairs. This is the ladder you can get to the third bed. And then where's the door? <laughs> and then this is the other bedroom. The inside of the builder's hut is pretty much the same as the last upgrade, but I'll show you guys what it looks like anyways. So this is the main floor. And then the upstairs. And then we'll go downstairs. Ooh, sorry. So there's a couple of these racks around here. And the different color wool, I am I guess it's just aesthetic because there's really no purpose. But that's there. Uh, yeah, so that's pretty much it for the builder's hut. Is this... Yeah, level three. Yeah, and this house is a level three as well. So because our original builder, Houston Jones, died, we don't have any other male citizens. All of the citizens that we have here are female. So that could be an issue. I'm not sure what I'd have to do to get a male citizen. I guess what I'm going to have to do then is I'm going to go ahead and upgrade the other house. This one being upgraded to a three should mean that we could get another citizen in here. But I think what we're gonna have to do is actually upgrade the town hall again. Okay, so this says that we have four of five citizens. So we should get another one, I would think. I guess I'm just gonna have to wait and see, but I do want to upgrade the town hall again here pretty soon. That's gonna have to wait though, because they're in mourning from Houston and our forester dying. I'm just gonna keep an eye on it and see if we get another citizen show up. Um, if not, after Maya's done finishing this wall here, this wall segment, I'm probably going to upgrade the other citizen's house so that we have a better chance of getting another male citizen. Uh, but if that doesn't work, I believe we can hire mercenaries. Um, I'll have to look into it, but I will update you guys whenever I figure it out. So I found this stray spawner a while ago, and I've been wanting to make an XP farm out of it and a way to get a bunch of bones. And oh my gravy goodness, was this a pain in the butt to get all these torches on here? Because this was all ice where there's cobble, like all of this, just ice everywhere. So the torches were melting it, and the water was just taking the torches away. So that was fun. I died probably like seven times. I also, when was placing torches, did not know that you could place one on the ceiling like this. <laughs> I was just trying to spam them anywhere they'd go. So yeah, you, you can place torches on the ceiling, apparently. Uh, but there's a chest here, so we're gonna check it out. Ooh, we got a name tag. That's awesome. Uh, here's a couple bones. We'll take those. I'll grab this horse armor. I mean, I don't really care about the ice, but
but we'll take the string ooh, cookie and I suppose we'll take those as well uh, but yeah I think I'm gonna try to turn this into a farm of sorts at some point I really want to get it done today but I don't know if I'll be able to do it today I might just make it its own video at some point possibly that is the update for now other than the builder is finishing up on the second citizen's house um oh 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 good gravy i need to figure my way out of here that's a shovel but she's finishing up the second citizen's house and then we'll see what citizen shows up because we should get another one uh since there'll be oh for the love that's just pg um but we will see what citizen comes because we're definitely going to need another male citizen if, if we want to continue populating our colony here so i'm going to sleep i'm gonna see what's going on and i will update you guys in a little bit hey pardon the interruption but there's a little announcement type of thing that i need to address here you can look at this potato while i announce it and also yeah. this right here uh yeah i'm going to be streaming on twitch here pretty soon can't exactly tell you when i have no idea but i'm super excited super anxious but mostly excited <laughs> i'll let everybody know when it's happening for sure but yeah there's uh there's that enjoy the rest of the video okay guys a decent size update here first of all i want to show you guys i got some doggies <laughs> I haven't named them yet. Uh, we just got that name tag from the chest where the stray spawner is. So I'm thinking we're going to name one of the dogs. I'm not sure which one. But if you guys have any name suggestions, please leave them in the comments. I would love to hear what you guys have. Uh, the other thing that we have to update on is the town hall is upgraded. This is what it looks like. I think it looks pretty cool. I'm really liking this one. So this is what the town hall looks on the back side. Uh, but this is the inside here. It's starting to look really cool. I like this a lot. There's a lectern in here. Hello. Yeah, and then this is the door to go out to the front. So yeah, this is the front. Anyway, uh, this is a little room for a lectern. That's, that's nice. There's a little downstairs area. I guess in further upgrades, there's going to be stuff down here. So that's really cool. Uh, but that's it for this one, I think. Yeah. But I really like the way that this build looks. It's at a level 4 now, I believe. So that's awesome. We can... I have to check. So we are able to have 6 citizens now. Which is great because we need a miner. And I have to build a hospital as well. So once we get our other citizens, that'll be really great. Since upgrading... The other citizens house i haven't gotten any new citizens i don't know what the deal is with that but i'm just going to continue to keep an eye on it and hopefully by the time the next episode comes we'll have more and hopefully it'll be a male citizen <laughs> so that we can continue having babies and whatnot the other thing that i forgot to mention earlier was uh we also lost our researcher to some pillagers there was a little pillager raid so one of the new citizens that we got her name is penelope i think so now we have two penelopes but one of them is our new researcher the other thing is the second house has been upgraded so it looks the same as the other one uh but that's done the third thing that's going on is we're continuing work on our walls here she's doing this third segment uh we're going to keep going pretty much around the whole perimeter of our town i want to say as the town gets bigger and such, we'll have different wall sections and stuff. So this will be like the inner inner portion and then we'll have some more things on the outside of the other one and then a wall around that and you get it. <laughs> uh, but that is that. The other thing is I finished the stray XP farm. So I'm going to head down there real quick and I'll show you guys what that looks like before the server restarts in 10 minutes. So it's down here. And it's just this little section here and I've got a diamond sword in here that I'll probably put an enchant on. I mean, we don't really need it because I've got my regular sword, but we just stand here 
kill them, get the XP, and then we get the arrow of slowness, regular arrows, and of course bones. So that's really cool. I'm, I've been wanting to do this farm for a while because I just need the bones for all the dyes and whatnot. I think that's going to be the end of this episode. Thank you guys so much for watching, and I will see you next time. Bye!